go. All right. This is what I'm going to um, show you how to do. It comes uh, as a laser cut. Okay. Laser cut kit. So I thought there's really not going to be uh, anything too terribly hard about this. And so this is what you get in your kit. You need a fat quarter of a batik. Well, since what you see through the okay. batik. They probably couldn't see it because your shirt's black. <laughs> there you go. This is what you get with the kit. It's already been laser cut. It's on fusible. So all I have to do is pull the paper off, lay this down, and iron it on. I've picked an orange for the background because everything that's cut out, the orange will show through. So let's just look at this. And... I'm going to fold that paper back and then just peel it. It does say to be careful as you're doing it because some of these things are very, very fragile. So we're testing their product um, live. Like I said, I haven't done this before. Oh my. It's really not hard. It's coming off easy. I'm just going slow because I don't want to uh, tear up part of the jack-o'-lantern's faces. So it's just peeling off there great, even the very thin parts. And I've got a little tiny section right here I want to get the paper off of. So I'm going to support it a little bit more, although I think it probably would have been just fine. Okay, so now the paper's off. I did not leave any black on the paper. Let's figure out which way is the top. I think this is the top. Okay. It says once you get it on there, kind of pat it into place. I'm looking to see if I see anything shiny. I do not see anything shiny. The shiny would be something that was flipped over and would have blue on it. Um, and then it says, uh, after I've patted it for it, make sure that I have at least an inch around. Well, I think I have plenty of, of fabric around. And so I'm going to make sure my iron is hot. And it says just to press it down on there and not to overheat it because you can make the glue um, go away if you overheat it. Now let's see if that did it. Looks like. Okay, I think that was fairly easy. All right, now I want to show you what else this does. Um, this isn't all you get in the kit. What did I do with the rest of it? Um, it comes with a hoop that you would put around it. Um, it'll go underneath it, of course. And then they have you pink the edges. It also comes with a chain and a um, little suction cup thing. There it is. So if you needed some really fast um, Halloween decoration, So you would hook the kit. The black part is fabric. It's kind of stiff fabric. You would put this on here with the suction cup. Uh, you glue uh, your. Um, it says use some permanent glue that dries clear to hold your um, hoop together once you've got it in there, and then you've got a decoration. You use a pinking blade to cut out around this, and it's done. So that was just as easy as they said it would be. Nice. Yeah, so those... See where they pinked it. Yeah, <laughs> the pinking out around here. So your, your orange fabric would be kind of a frame work outside the hoop. And if you're interested in one of those kits, um, they are...